Hello, my name is Lewis and welcome back to Gathering the Magic and today, yes, it's time, we're opening the Core 2021 Booster Box. Make sure that you do give this video a nice little like and why not subscribe down below as well for more Magic the Gathering content. And let's see. Okay, let me just adjust this, put all the packs to the side. <clears throat> There we go, let's cut out all the nice boring bits, get to what you've come to watch, packs being opened as quick as possible. Obviously, in this set we're looking for that Teferi, looking for that Ugin. Can we get anything good? So, let's go straight to the Uncommons. Chandra, nice, that is a very, very good card. Not sure how much it's worth, I think it's only about three or four qua qua quound. Sir, are you okay? I'm a little messed up. Three or four quid, or pound, as I was trying to say. And uh, yeah, very good start. As you may or may have not seen in a previous video, I did do the pre-release tournament where I opened six packs, managed to get the Gargaroth, so it'll be interesting to see if we can get Gargi again, or something even better. Maybe one of those alternate art tutors. Lost Scale Kotal and Mangara, very popular, very popular card and a nice Mythic. That's a back-to-back -back Mythics in the first two packs and a really cool forest there and trash, literal trash. I'll just put the rest. Actually, let's not let's not waste space. I'll put all these put all these off to the side. If I do if I do miss out anything good, then please do let me know in the comments. And actually, why not? write in the comments what the best pulls you've had so far are that'd be pretty cool to know let's see quickly go through these commons no one comes for the commons do they transmogrify it's hoping for three back-to-back -back mythics but that's uh that's never gonna happen is it pretty pretty cool card and a beast token Hope everyone is doing well. Obviously now, I don't know where it is, depending on your location, but lockdown restrictions are slowly being eased. So hopefully we can get some more paper magic on the go shortly. Oh, very nice Liliana's steward. Let's put that in the, in the random pile I've got here. Complement and peer into the abyss. Great card, <laughs> great card, and great for memes as well. Turn into slag foil. And obviously speaking of memes, do make sure that you check out our Instagram, which I'll just put on the screen now, whilst I'm struggling to open this pack. See Meme Master Steve do all of his glory. Okay, let's have a look. And what are we going to have? Temple of Silence. Nah. Disappointing. Disappointing. And more cardboard trash. So 36 packs in this box. I think someone online I read that on average you get probably about six mythics per box. So I've, I've got two already. So the rest of this might not be that great. But we're still praying for one of those many, many, many Teferi. And Sporeweb Weaver, very cool card, Reach and Hexproof from Blue. You can go in the rare pile, oh, nice foil planes and a Goblin Wizard. Nice variety of tokens in this set, not just loads of different human soldiers. God, I hate them. So, so much. Okay, and straight through to the next one. Are we going to get a Chromatic Orrery? Oh. Nearly revealed something back to them there. Invigorating Surge. Conspicuous Snoop. Card that was in my very recent video, the top 10 best cards for C21 and Commander. So do check that out. And into the next one. I really should keep count of how many I'm doing, but well, we'll just see when the power starts to get low. Okay. Crab. Shock. Great card, Liliana's Devotee. Another alternate art, nice little uncommon there. And Chandra's Incinerator. 
For a set that's based on Teferi, there sure is a lot of Chandra in this set. They do love her, don't they? I think she was the focal point of Core 20 as well last year, so maybe it's, a, maybe it's time for someone else to get the spotlight and not Chandra. Let's have a look. She even had that secret spell book thing, didn't she? Which I bought and I opened, but yeah, it wasn't good. Ah, oh, yes. Not a mythic, but a card again in my top 10 list, and it is just amazing, isn't it? Counter target spell ability, have a token, return a creature, draw a card. It's got everything, and then a little bit more as well. Foil, short strike, dismal backwater, and a bird. I really think with these dual lands, they need to start getting some variety. I feel like it's been the same, same sort of ones in the last god knows how many sets now. Okay. Here we go, Truffle Snout, great card. Okay, Fashion Blow, Sanctum of the Stone Fangs, and Feline Sovereign, very cool card. Could go with Rin and Seri very well. And the cats get one at one and have protection from dogs. Very nice. And a treasure token. Nothing yet that's made me go, ooh. As we go on to the next one, is this going to be, should I tap it? Teferi, Teferi, be in there somewhere. Or Prickly Marmoset. Let's have a look, let's have a look. Volcanic Salvo, again, not a mythic, this is the rare. Cool card though, lovely art. Okay, I mean, there's no, there's no Prickly Marmoset in this set, but He's always going to make his way into the videos. Okay. I feel it. I feel it. There's a mythic. There's a mythic in here. Let's have a look. Ooh, Jorel. Another really cool card. Very, very good in Commander. Would love to have that. Oh, what have we got? Oh, it's a double rare. It's a foil. Win, win. As you may see by all of the uh, packs around here, I am trying to get as many packs from all of the sets as possible. Maybe do like a jumbo pack opening of like, a, oh, nearly knocked my camera over. A jumbo pack opening of, of all the sets. If you think that'd be cool, let me know. If you've got any, any old packs as well, hit me up. Oh, little, little alternate. Basri's Acolyte. Basri kept one of the new Planeswalkers, but I don't think you'll see a lot of play. Oh yes! Massacre Worm. Amazing. And I tried my hardest not to make a weird ooh sound as some of my friends say that I do. Amazing card. Absolutely love this. Brilliant. And you go into the mythic pile. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay. Here we go, next one. Yeah, as I said, let me know what the best cards you've pulled are from this set. I would be quite interested to know. Oh, poor little Colossal Dreadmore. He's got nothing on the Gargi, has he? Cordia Pegasus Sentinel, Waker of Waves, a good card that I used in my pre-release. And Carvec, Spiteful, another, another good legendary creature. Just a rare, but very, very good. And the foil is Silent Dart. Again, I won't do it for, for all of the cards, but if the card's worth maybe like more than a few quid, I'll put the I'll put the price on. I mean with any set it's gonna it's gonna tumble. So if you do pull these really, really good cards, then maybe uh maybe get rid. Get rid sell make some money. Nice, very good, very good card for uh for milling. I've seen a lot of this in arena. And what do we have here? We have demonic embrace. Pretty cool card, plus three plus one has flying. And you can pay it or cast it from your graveyard. And ah, oh, a nice little alternate land, which I do think look very, very cool. And a cat. Just try and speed through these, try and get through as many as possible. I really don't like to make the video too long because who wants to sit here for 30 minutes? I think my, my very early videos, the three boxes of Aquaria I did, 
all about 30 minutes. Quite long. Okay, and Fabled Passage reprint from Eldraine, which in my opinion, very, very needed. Who wants to be spending like a tenner just on a on a Fabled Passage? Rightfully deserves the card to go down in value. I think now it's already plummeted to about, I don't know, fiver. Something like that, and oh, advert for Jumpstart, which looks very, very fun. I like, I like the idea in principle, but not really something I think I'd, I'd buy. Prismite, Sanctum of the, getting a few, getting a few shrines here, pretty cool, and a solemn sit. Phil, so, I think it's happened again. Solemn Simulacrum, getting another cool, cool card. Get those lands out, draw your cards, and another alternate swamp. I wonder if we've got one of every one of every colour now. Like I said earlier in the video, it's pretty interesting to see how many mythics we get from this. I'm guessing that when they do sort of print these cards, they make it fairly balanced. I'm guessing we will probably end up with about four to six. But we want, we want more, don't we? We want them all. Give me more Teferi. Not more Teferi, give me a Teferi. And Primal Might almost went straight past it. Cool, cool sorcery. I think it'd work better as an instant, but hey-ho. Okay, and straight on to the next one. Will Liliana give us Liliana? We shall see. Mind rot possibility. Grasp of Darkness, getting onto the Uncommons now. And what are we gonna, ah, oh, Temple of Epiphany. Not what I wanted to see. And a demon, how many tokens are there? 18, cool little variety. Okay, if we go to Teferi, Teferi will give us the Teferi, won't it? Teferi for Teferi seems fair. Pride Mountain, again, another card that works well in my Simic pre, oh, that's, Pretty, pretty nice alternate. Yeah, Pride Marking worked very well in my Simic tournament. Amazement, Maze Mind Tome, Again, nothing, nothing special. And what is this? A foil alternate Garrox Uprising. A very cool card. I've seen this a fair bit in Arena as well. I think that will be a very popular card for the years to come. Ah, waste of cardboard. Okay, Chandra, what have you got for me? It's gonna get me the dub. Oh, terrible. That, that pun shocked me. How come you suck? Um, I lack confidence. Um, <laughs> uh, let's have a look. Meteorite, Teferi's Tutelage, and another rare land. This is just a rare land box, isn't it? Rare land waste of cardboard box but I think it must be at least halfway through now if not more so what are we going to get are we going to see a prickly mama set I somehow doubt it Baron very nice really really cool card I do like it not really something that I will use but pretty damn cool Ah, oh, soldiers. Let's just neaten up these foils. Okay. Fair handful left. Let's try and get that to fairy, please. This one has to fairy in. I'll eat my hat. Not to fairy, so I won't eat the hat that I don't even own, but this is a card that I personally wanted. This is wicked. I'm not sure why I didn't put this in my, uh, I don't know why I didn't put this in my top 10 list. But that is a very nice card. And again, a mythic, which we've not seen in a while. That's four mythics now. So will it be right? Will we have six mythics in a box? I mean, I'd rather have 10 mythics in a box, but we shall see. Uh, quickly, thank everyone for subscribing. I've only sort of been going with this channel about a month and a half now and already at nearly 100 subscribers, which is very cool. 
What's not cool though is another double double lamb. We definitely must have all of them now. And cultivate. Who doesn't love a spare cultivate for their commander decks? But yeah. Um, Loving making all these sort of videos, so if that you do have any ideas for top 10 lists or even stuff that you want me to open, do let me know and uh, I will be sure to try it. To Fairies, Poche. It's another Sanctum, Leaking Adventure, Containment Priest. Nice card, nothing to get too excited about though. I'm not gonna scream like a little girl if it was Ugin. I would quite actually like a fiery emancipation. Who wouldn't want a fiery emancipation? Rambunctious mud. There are some cool cards. Again, another shrine. I must be getting close to having all the shrines. Spark Hunter Master Core. Already got that a few packs ago in foil, but now we've got the normal one. Night. Okay. We're getting low. We're getting low. Yeah, the, uh, the art on these packs, the art on the packs here, they're definitely missing a certain, certain marmer set, aren't they? Wall of Runes, legendary card. Took me to a few victories on Arena when it really shouldn't have. Okay, and Scavenging Ooze, wiki card, again, was in that list. If you do want to check it out, I'll put a picture up now. But yeah, very, very good card I can see that doing bits in a future deck and oh, foil, foil land and a demon nine packs to go nine more chances it's gonna it's gonna happen isn't it it's gonna happen it's gonna happen let's have a look what a carry on try I'd love it sanctum of all Nice, nice. Not a mythic, but a very, very good shrine. The uh, the best of the shrines, really. I mean, doing a shrine deck is not something that I'm going to do or interested in, but got to gotta catch them all, ain't ya? Okay, here we go. Pride marking again. Swift response. Wake up waves. And... Hooded Blight Fang. Hooded Blight Fang. Cool card. Could go well with Vito. And some more treasure. If only I had the real treasure, we know what I'm talking about. Here we go. I feel like this is on the top of most of these packs. Port oh, Porticulus Vine. Basri's Acolyte. Oh, lovely card, lovely card. Niambi, esteemed speaker. Lots of really interesting, cool legendaries in this set. This is definitely another one that I do like the look of. <gasps> oh my God, there we go. That is exactly what I wanted. A rare and a mythic, is that? Oh, I thought it was foil then, I was gonna absolutely mental but that's really really cool that's really really cool rare and a mythic double usually one of them spoiled but grim tutor alternate i don't know how much this is going for i think it was about 13 pounds last time i saw prices are definitely definitely tumbling but oh that is lovely one of my friends ruben at the uh, pre-release he did manage to pull that i was very jealous of but now I am no longer jealous. I feel reinvigorated. I feel energised. I feel ready to get back-to-back -back mythics. And we have... Ah, Stormwing Entity. Cool card, but not a mythic. Again, with the uh, prowess mechanic returning. Pretty, pretty good card to use in there. And my pile of commons and commons is now almost toppling over. Okay. Four to go, and this is the one. This is the one. Let's, let's tap out that Teferi. There we go. Manoir Visionary, Chandra's Magmut. Pack Leader. 
definitely the, the best of the uh, the new doggo cards that the dogs get. Plus one, plus one. I feel like this one should have been like the same as the cat one though. I feel like it should have had protection from cats. Would have been would have been nice. And a sapling. Okay. Oh, I thought there's three left. There is four left. Let's do it. So there's one of one of each. Turn to Slag. Here we go. I hope you have enjoyed this video so far. And uh, let's have a what are we going to... Oh, that was the rare. Disappointed! Nearly totally missed it. Ghostly Pilferer Spirit Rogue. And the Foil Goblin Wizardry. Not too many foils in this compared to Aquaria, but still... Nice whenever you get one, and a beast, and a tranquil coat. Should have kept my eye on the tokens, cup. I've no idea how many, how many um, I've got. Struggled with that. Okay, three packs left. Let's uh, let's pray for the best. Maybe uh, hit the like button down below. That will uh, that will definitely definitely help me in getting a, a mythic. Garrox uprising, Liliana standard bearer. Very nice, cool, rare alternate. I'm a big fan. Let's do we put that in the rares? Do we put that in the alternate? Let's, let's put it there. Actually, we can go over here. What can it, guys? Uh, oh, the pack that keeps on giving. Another alternate and a soldier. Okay, let's let's save to fairy for the end. Cool. Oh, I can't open it. There we go. Tapping. If anyone wants to know uh, about tapping, there you go. Okay, two to go. Let's get a mythic. I feel there's definitely one in these last two packs, isn't there? And pack leader again. Ah, oh, ooh. And a foil Skyway sniper. Here we go, on to the last pack. Here he is, we're ready to get him. Thank you everyone for watching this video. Uh, if you did enjoy it, please do hit that like button and subscribe down below. And let's see, if we uh, if we get to Fairy now, I will buy a collector's booster box straight away. And open it. And are we ready? Oh. <laughs> Uh, trash, trash, end with, end with, not a bang, but a whimper. Well, like I just said, thank you everyone for watching. Let's have a look at the best of the best. Grim Tutor, Garrick Unleashed, Massacre Worm, Mangara, and Chandra. And a load of rares there, which was pretty cool. Yeah, so thanks for thanks for watching. If you haven't already, do hit that subscribe button. And for now, I am all tapped out and knackered. So I will see you in the next one.